Now we're going to insert the 50B master die, outbend master die into the number two hospital bender. You take the 50B uh, outbend master die and the 53B wrist pin, you pin it together in the second three quarter hole of the bender main uh, swinging frame. And uh, by doing that, you just slide it together, come back from underneath, up comes the pin, you slide the pin frames together, then we're going to go back to the fifth three-quarter hole of the main frame of the bender main frame. We're going to pin it into the first three-quarter hole of the bender swinging frame. Once again, now we have our wrist action. You can see your die moves. The bend, the die is actually held in the bender between the, the swinging frame. The, the pin slides between the frames. It gives you a wrist action. Okay. Now we insert the. 51B, this is a 30 inch radius block. That's going to go in first on the table of the uh, master die. Then we insert the 52B uh, outer radius block, which goes on the 20B, 20B center pin. We'll just slide that together like so, and your dies are in the bender. And it's a, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, Male female type die where the die is squeezed together. Make sure that your center pin does go all the way through, otherwise, your block will tilt and um, you'll get a bad bend. This bender is hooked up for the hydraulic attachment. You can make your bends either manually or hydraulically by just inserting this, uh, this wrist, this, this pin here. It's not a wrist pin, it's a hydraulic pin. And you can make it hydraulic or manually, whatever is faster or easier for you. Uh, then we're going to insert our stock. Our stock goes flange out underneath the 51B block here. It slides right underneath there. Slides between the blocks, slides between both blocks, as you can see, and you can proceed with your bend.